Hello and welcome to the fresh new episode of Lifestyle with Dr. Taha. You are beautiful. Life is beautiful. You are important. Your life is very important. We will touch base today. Five things to avoid in your life and you need to stop it right now. And we will touch base today the three basic core essentials of your life. Yes, viewers, we were talking about the basic core essentials of life. I have figured it out, like three things are very important in your life. Like we are dealing with, with every, every single day that uh, 60 to 90% of the cases, which, what we encounter in a daily basis, in our daily basis uh, in the office, we have seen that these are stress related uh, things going on. And the stress is the major cause, uh, core, core factor in all the related diseases. But we, when we talk about the obesity, uh, we have uh, seen that the diet and exercise has a major role uh, in the reduction of obesity. What we call the diet, in diet we have to be very simple, we have to take straight forward and we have to take an easiest approach in order to get rid of all the extra fat. But what we can do is like drink plenty of water, a lot of psyllium which is very easily available over the counter you can get a lot of psyllium and husk and a lot of you know the biscuits an apple a day keeps a doctor away this is a very normal uh, natural saying and which is very true so you have to be very straightforward approach you have to take that pathway that needs to be like you can you can have it on a daily basis so your diet needs to be very simple very straightforward it has to be when we talk about exercise 30 minutes of daily exercise on a just like a walk if we say just like a walk 30 minutes or 20 minutes every single day it can reduce a lot of stress it can reduce a lot of risk factors that is related to your cardiovascular diseases so we have to be very straightforward in that approach as well if we talk about uh, surgery and the other things which are going on, rocks and Y loop, and we talk about the gastric bypass, or we talk about a sleeve gastrectomy. We, that, those approaches, you need to, we always recommend you to uh, ask about your doctor, your primary care physician, and schedule an appointment. Schedule an appointment is very important. We are here to give you an approach and to give you a sense of knowing what's going on in your mind and what's going on in your body. So we are here to advise you, but you have to talk to your doctor. Schedule an appointment is the basic issue. Yes, years. when we talk about increasing libido, that is also very essential core of life. What we can do, just a simple method. Uh, caffeine without creamer or sugar and a bit of dark chocolate. That would be sufficient. And it's very easy. When we talk about uh, anti-aging process, Time and age is a natural process. What uh, we can do about, uh, we just can slow down the process of aging, but we cannot halt the time. But viewers, you have several times you have seen that uh, someone is telling you like, uh, oh, I went to my doctor and he says, uh, like my heart is a 20 year old heart, but my, I, I'm 60 year old. And sometimes on the contrary, you have seen a woman going to a doctor with a, some knee problem and the doctor said, oh, you, your knee is like 70 year old knee, but your age is 35. So why it happens? Sometimes we can slow down the process of aging. I will talk here a little bit about a DNA. DNA is a, is a factor of life where every, all the genome and everything is written in your DNA when you were born, like how long you will live, how healthy you will be, how beautiful you will be. So in DNA, the repair of DNA is a natural process as well. There is always, it's a, like a destruction of DNA and there's a repair of DNA. In order to re repair DNA eff effectively and very quickly, we need to have, we must have vitamin B12. So this is, this is a little bit description of vitamin B12, what it does to, to your DNA. And DNA, it, it, it affects your aging process as well. Everything is related to DNA. So when we talk about vitamin B12, we have anti-aging, we have to have a simply, simply, very simple method is to have your vitamin B12. Consult your doctor, schedule an appointment with your doctor, and you will find which vitamin is very essential in core. 
and you, you can have these vitamins very easily over the counter. Hi viewers, now I will tell, about, uh, tell you about something very interesting about how studies have proven that depression is not only like a, like a depression, it's a clinical depression. Clinical depression is a terminology when we use it uh, like there are chemical triggers, chemicals that releases in our body in times of stress and that causes different things physiologically as well as mentally and it affects our body. Very interestingly, a very, very important thing you need to know, like 60 to 90 percent of all office visits of all the patients are related to stress. It means that the stress is related to a lot of diseases. You name it and you find it. It is directly related to stress. How it works? We have higher brain centers. Hypothalamus is the seat of all the chemicals. That is the response, in, that is the kind of response we all, we all naturally have. In hypothalamus, hypothalamus signals to pituitary gland. It's a small gland in the brain as well. And then the chemical releases through adrenal glands. Adrenal is, adrenal is a small, small walnut-shaped uh, gland that is behind uh, our kidneys. Through adrenal gland, epinephrine and norepinephrine releases. We normally call it adrenaline. That is the chemical which we have during fight, flight, and fear. In those circumstances, this is the natural, natural chemical that releases. We need that. But what is the counter mechanism in order to calm down our stress in our body naturally is the vagus nerve. Vagus is the nerve, we call it a wonder, wonder nerve normally. It calms down and it soothes your body. It decreases your blood pressure. Naturally, this is the natural counter phenomena in case of your stress in, that deals naturally with your stress. When we talk about vagus nerve, it calms down your body, it slows down all the stomach problems, it, it slows down your gut feelings, like normally in case of stresses, we do have like, you know, stomach things. And we have high uh, heart rate, the breathing slows down. This is all because of vagus nerve. Viewers, this is the mind-body connection. We were talking about the vagus nerve. Now, the what I need to emphasize here at this point is like the key, the key to all the stresses is meditation. You focus. You focus on prayers and there are different types of meditations what we do. Normally what we can do while we are driving, while we are like, you know, working on a desk, what we can do, focus on your breathing. When you inhale, what you do, you repeat this word, I am. And when you exhale, you repeat this word, happy. Do it for 10 minutes. You will find the difference. What will happen after some time, your higher brain centers will start working. It will be activated and it will soothe this and it will trigger the chemical that soothes your mind and your body and decreases your heart rate to the normal level. Viewers, here I would like to talk about a teen issue. I have encountered a boy who, is, who was like 20 years old and his mother was telling me that he has like a, a kind of a strange behavior for past like few weeks. Dura here duration is very important. So we need to listen. I, I'm just giving you the awareness. You need to schedule an appointment. If you see any kid or any teen uh, doing a kind of a strange behavior like kind of uh, lack of sleep, lack of interest, lack of socializing or like kind of lack of concentration, kind of like a, a behavior which you just feel like it is something, there's something going on. You need to schedule an appointment with, with your doctor. What doctor would do? Uh, in these cases, the general physical examination is essentially normal. The routine blood test like ESR, what we do in case of like, these are the routine blood tests, we do it. Uh, to find out any inflammatory condition is going on. We do ESR and thyroid function test. In these cases, these are essentially normal. So the doctors normally recommend if the duration of lack of interest, lack of concentration, uh, like sleep deprivation, 
uh, kind of like a recurrent headaches, a feeling of fatigue, hopelessness. These kind of things are very common in teenagers as well and in ad adults as well. These are the signs of clinical depression. So you need to be aware of these kind of signs, schedule an appointment with your doctor and the doctor would do a routine physical exam and the routine blood test and after that they might would recommend antidepressant. A trial of antidepressant is a treatment in that case. So, so you need to know about the conditions the teens are going on. Viewers, welcome. We just wanted to make sure that you are healthy, you are beautiful, and you are stress-free. This is wa what the basic uh, intention of this program is, to make you more aware of what is going on inside your body and inside your mind, and what, how, to, how to live a stress-free life. So uh, here we need to emphasize on those things which you need to stop taking or you need to avoid at this time. If you are consuming sugar, stop taking sugar. It is like it is it is related to many things. It is related to high like obesity, which is like very common these days, and it is related to all it's it's a it's a big no-no, sugar. <laughs> Viewers, we should not forget about increasing incidence of cancer these days. Any kind of cancer, regardless of any age. It is increasing at this time. We must not forget to avoid these, these things in our life. We must stop smoking. Smoking is directly related to many types of cancers, like esophageal cancer, gastric cancer, or prostate, breast carcinoma. It is related. We should not forget about the lung cancer as well. So the increasing incidence of cancers in women and men, both is increasing at this time. We, we should stop avoiding alcohol, stop smoking, exercise regularly, obesity control is also very important, reduction, we have just, we were spoken about it, uh, how to reduce obesity. <laughs> Viewers, when we talk about vascular diseases, cardiovascular diseases, or any kind of a stroke, or any kind of, or any type of cancer, the women's ha are increasing number of lung cancer in women as well is related to smoking and the breast cancer every type of cancer we need we can stop it we can reduce the risk of cancer by proper screening at proper age like at the age of 40 the women's needs to have their mammogram and at the age of 50 the the men and women both need to have their colonoscopy so we have to have these things in mind. We need not to forget about exercise. The importance of exercise every day, 20 minutes or 30 minutes, a daily walk can prevent us from many, many diseases. Okay viewers, thank you so much for connecting with us, for staying with us and watching our show. Please, in case of emergency, do call 911 or consult your doctor. If you have any health issues going on and you want to know about it and you want to know what's going on and you have any questions or queries, do call us or do write us at this email. We need your response. We need your feedback about our episode. This show is all about you, your beauty, your life, your healthy lifestyle. Keep watching our show, Lifestyle with Dr. Taha.